that's longer than a jet engine. It takes your breath away, and it shakes your eyeballs loose. You know, it rattles, it rattles your eyeballs inside your head. There's no doubt that Steve's monster stereo has one heck of a bite. But how can sound shape those windows? So you might not think that sound is very powerful, but it is still a way of transferring energy. So the speaker cones will hit molecules of air, they will hit other molecules of air, and they will transfer what is quite a large amount of kinetic energy from molecule to molecule, and all of that energy has to go somewhere. And if there's a window in the way, it will hit that window, and all of that energy will be transferred. But rattling window panes is child's play. Steve Mead is on TV for once. Turn chips to grunts. Shatter glass. And make his wife's hair stand on end. Quite literally. Men with massive speakers in their cars. Why do they do that? I don't know. I think I'm just a boy who never grew up, you know? I don't want to grow up.